about the new T800, uh, our top of the line commercial machine for buckle folding. Just the features that really make this machine different. Belts ride against the driven full width bottom belt. So you don't get any gapping and you don't get any spacing out when you run your load around. Lots of easy access. Unfortunately, sometimes your operator is going to load this thing backwards and have to get in there or you're going to have to pull a job to run 500 or something else. Super easy access to get in here. You can control the load speed from right here when you're setting up the machine. Side aeration, front aeration, angle of attack aeration, level of the lead edge to the suction belt, all right here for the operator. Double sheet detector, right here, very simple. Vivas infeed system is our vacuum belt side guy and our vacuum belt feed wheel, which is really important and unique to MBO. The flat feed belt has a tendency to flatten out curl in sheets and you also have more room to adjust the vacuum point forward and backwards than you would on a conventional suction wheel. The suction tape on the side guide is in two sections so you can use more suction in the back to pull the sheet out of the feeder and less suction in front for very sensitive stocks so that you don't jam the sheet against the side guide. Standard in the United States, all the machines have uh, pre-slitter shaft and six, six fold plates in the parallel section. All of our machines, whether they're touch, whether they're automated or not, have this, basically the same touch screen and the operator gets all of the same information. The difference is that if it's an automated machine, the information goes directly to the servos and the machine sets itself up. If it's a non-automated machine, the information is here for the operator to look at and reference to help him set the machine up manually. Next best feature, I'll get Jack to pull this out. I, uh, work. Slitter, shaft, slitter shaft access and it's so easy to change any tools that you need to. A lot of companies keep a spare set of slitter shafts with the pre-made make ready on it. So when they go from job to job, they just swap out the slitter shafts. The other MBO exclusive that I really like, and this is really performance oriented, are the cones instead of marbles. Marbles, it's impossible not to have them bounce or slip a little bit. The cones, there's a disc on the back side of the cone that drives the cone and there's only about an eighth of an inch of contact point on the edge of the sheet for the cones to drive the sheet. This system will get the sheet moving in the next direction about 20% 20, 20 faster than any other uh, method on the market, whether it's marbles from a competitor or whether it's marbles on our economy machines. On this machine we're using an 880 stacker which is a smart stacker. It can stack uh, piles of signatures in any uh, quantity that the operator desires and in this case we push out of the stacker into the Kobo stack which is an automated palletizer. This is a cobot, so we don't need a cage around it. If this were an operation, and I were just to even brush this, it would stop in place. So it's uh, operator safe without a cage. It can stack the two sides. It's smart, it knows when this one is full. And then it'll start stacking that one, and an operator or a helper can come over, move this skin, put a new one in, and when that skin fills up, it'll start stacking here. So. That's what we were showing off today. Um, hope this little uh, tutorial helps you make a decision on your folder purchases. And if you have any questions, please contact MBO America. And we have five or six of us experts here to answer your questions.